Today I'm going to show you a couple of quick ways to open up project folders inside Visual Studio Code. So the old school or the slow way of doing it is that you click on your app icon, you fire up the Visual Studio Code, and then you maybe you had it open recently, then it should be down here, then you can click on more to see more recent, or you can just go to open folder, locate your folder, click open and so on, right? Now that's the slow way. So instead, let's go to our terminal. And then we navigate to the uh, project directory or the, the place where you have stored your your projects, right? So right now I'm in my root PWD, you can see my I'm in my root, and I'm going to navigate to my dev directory. And now I want to open up a a, a directory or a folder called gastrofy. So now I'm going to do cd gastrofy. And now I'm inside it, right? Now if I do code dot and hit enter, now it opens up. Now you might think to yourself that this is not, I mean, it's not that fast, but it is fast if you're used to using your terminal. So if you're a developer or an aspiring developer, or you're just used to using your terminal for doing a bunch of things, it's probably already open. Then you can probably imagine that this is pretty fast, right? Now there's another way you can do this. And I'm just going to shut this down again. If I go back one step CD dot dot. And so now I'm in my dev directory again. Now if I do code, and then the name of my project, and then I hit enter, then it's also going to open. So these are just two different ways of opening the project. Okay. Now, one thing that's important is that if you are on a Mac computer, and this is a new installation of your Visual Studio code, then this is probably not going to work. So hopefully you didn't skip this video, because this didn't work on your end. So the way you make it work is by going to view, and then you hit command palette. And then you look for this command shell command install code command and path. Don't pay too much attention to what this means. If you're sort of a beginner, it doesn't really matter. What matters is that this works. So if you just search for this, if it doesn't pop up on your end, just write shell command and it will automatically pop up. Okay, you ha have two options, you can install it or uninstall it. So just hit install. And then it will install. And now if you restart your Visual Studio code, you have to restart it first, then when you go to your terminal, then you can use the either code name of your project, or go directly to your project. And then you do the code dot and hit enter, and then it's going to open up. That's it for today. I hope this has been helpful. And if it has, let me know down in the comment section. And uh, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. I got a lot of cool things coming up in the near future.